Welcome to another installment of BS Talks. Uh, this is this is something that I, I'm I'm looking forward to. Uh, this is you know we go out and we gig or we party or we you know we're out about it. People are always asking us the same questions, and they're always thinking they're really clever. Um, uh, and so we, we get kind of tired of it. But I thought maybe we do something of a of a public service. If you I don't know what, what you call it, but just trying just like to facts. Uh, yeah. yeah so personal. so what we did was we we hit up a few of our friends on on social media and. We asked them to send us questions that they had, and uh, to keep to, to you know not give us their names necessarily, but but put it kind of with a you know like a username or something, so that we wouldn't be biased when we answered it. But uh, I'm re looking forward to see what we've got. I'm interested um, to see what so, happens. Yeah, so let's see. Let's uh, we're calling this BS does FAQ. If you want to do that, uh, let's go right from the top. This one says, "How did you guys come up with the name Backhand Sally?" And this one's from Lovely Lady. So um, I'll let you tell this one. <laughs> Well, lovely lady, as you know, any good band name um, usually has a good story. So ours just stems from a lot of arguing back and forth over names I thought were good, names he thought were good. We couldn't agree on anything. I was watching an old film, and they made a, a little quip in there, and Spencer Tracy or somebody says, I got a backhand for Sally, making kind of a, a joke that he was going to hit <laughs> Sorry, trying to say that we're advocating violence towards women. Absolutely not, but it was a common phrase used back in the 40s or whatever. It, it, it you know, it's just like a, it's meant in jest. So I condensed it down and so I now said, violence towards women is funny. No, that's not what I said. The phrase is meant in jest. Anyway, I got a backhand for Danny. <laughs> anyway, I said, hey, how about we should backhand Sally? That's kind of funny, kind of cute. And, you know, maybe we have a funny. Funny name, and so after many names, it was the only one. That the only one that I didn't veto. Yeah, I had the vetoing power, and I I went through a hundred of them. That's true. Um, so. And no, neither one of us are Sally. Uh, that, oh yeah, we get that. Or asked, asked or, that or backhand. That's don't don't ask that. Um, <laughs> next question. It says, Danny, uh, I've read nearly every one of your stories and posts. Are they all really true? Uh, this was coming from Joystick. I, you got to wonder where these names are coming from. I like that though. Um, or maybe your name is joy you know or stick but uh, um, <laughs> so it says uh, uh, you know are they all true yes everything that, that we did we put uh, everything is is true and to, just to answer shortly um, I, I do change some things here and there I change I might change a name or a location maybe or you know like if if I did something on a Tuesday that, that, that you know I wouldn't put it up on Wednesday because it's fresh in that person's mind frankly most of this crap is about you guys and the things that we do together so <laughs> I try to keep it uh, pretty, pretty uh, anonymous, and I like, I like to maintain, you know, that, that people's privacy. Uh, so yeah, everything is true, but there are some liberties taken, like I said, with, with names and, and things like that. So, so there you go. Uh, this one says, "Does Danny really drink as much as your posts indicate? Doesn't seem plausible or healthy." This comes from a concerned friend. Uh, well, concerned friend, the truth is, I'm being really honest here. He absolutely does. <laughs> Probably times two, but you know but, what? But, but who's counting, right? I mean, no, I, I got, I got, I will say this. I kind of have to, you know, don't share this outside of this circle, but I'll have to give him some credit that he's got like this remarkable capability to drink four times as much as any normal person and have no ill effects, no hangover. He can like do that and get up the next day, start all over again, play a gig, do it again, and just rinse and repeat. Me, I would have to go to like an emergency room for a week to recover, but not him. So it does impress me. Uh, Again, a, let's keep that amongst ourselves. It's a random gift, I guess, if you <laughs> want to call it that. Uh, I, I got, I do have a a, a, social, uh, a superpower though that, that maybe we, if anybody cares, I'll talk about that later. Um, here we go. This one's another question. This, this one says for me. It says, Danny, uh, how old are you? And this one, uh, <laughs> can I say that name? Um, <laughs> sure. Uh, you know, there's sensors and whatnot. Like, this is from a Milfy 69. I'm I'm not sure if she's trying to tell me that she's 69 years old, or if she was maybe born in 1960. I, I don't know. Um, but uh, normally, I don't. I wouldn't answer a personal question like that uh, directly. But um, seeing as how we were on on Facebook, you know, parading. My, you know, we had a big event. We did. Um, when I turned 30, just recently, almost killed Kimberly. Um, but she tried to hang uh, and party with us every day. Uh, but anyway, yeah. So I turned thirty. I did and, it though. Yeah, she did it, and she she hung in. So I'm I proud survived of her. for my birthday this month. So he just has to wait and see. Yeah, uh, she's. I'll she's, probably kill me too this month. But. Yeah, I think she might just kill me, just just Maybe. like as her prize, you know. 
so there you go, Milfi. Um, 30 years old. Uh, this one says, Danny. Um, here's another one for me. It says, what product, yeah. product, products do you, and she's got the little quotations or whatever, uh, do you use in your hair? Um, not hair, but product. Yeah. This says, uh, Green Envy. Uh, well, Miss Envy. Um, I, I, if you looked in the shower, I, I, I buy whatever is the cheapest at, at the local you know market or convenience store or whatever. Um, it's just like the 99 cent per barrel VO5 or Suave um, something just and it's just you know if there's a two-in-one or whatever whatever just I, I mean um, I, I, I my, my shampoo is like my liquor you know you go and and they got the, the good stuff and then I you know on the bottom shelf I had to kind of go to the bottom shelf and reach around the back and that's the shampoo that I use um, no two hundred dollar bottles of shampoo no nothing like that nothing like that at all but I do credit my hair health to my my diet um, we'll talk about oh. that <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, here we go. Um, um, I'm noticing like a trend here with questions. Like they're all it? about Danny. Danny, this. No, Danny that's no. Question. It's just no? those. I mean, it's just, we've only. It's just that's just the way they've come up though. Is I mean, it? Yeah. No. Let Is me go. Alphabetical or something. Yeah. No. Um, let me get one. There, there's um, there's a lot of them here for Kimberly. I'm sure. Let me just. Hmm. Um, because there's two two of us. That makes a duo. Two o. We are a, we are a two o. We are a two o. Uh, <laughs> yeah. There, we need to. I don't mind talking about myself every now and then. Uh, well, here we go. This one says Kimberly. See, Kimberly. Oh, okay, cool. Uh, how do you manage to put up with Danny? Okay, another question about Danny. Uh, no, well, well, we'll, I, we'll go, Pat. I mean, I'll we'll tell you who's that from. That's from. Oh, that's from Miss Cat Lover Twelve. Okay, Cat Lover Twelve. Is she, um, is she saying she's got twelve cats, maybe? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, I don't know. Um, maybe that's her age. I don't. Uh, I don't know. Uh, but Cat Lover Twelve, uh, lots of wine. Lots of prayer <laughs> and, and lots of wine. Um, yeah, look, but let me get you a better one. Here we go. Okay, and then here, Kimberly, it's now, and there's right back to back, Kimberly. It says, All right, two in a row. Kimberly, right. can I please have a new phone uh, from El Breezy? Um, um, little girl, no, but nice try. Uh, you gotta applaud her efforts. You absolutely do. Dang it. <laughs> Come on now. <laughs> um, anyway, okay, so here, okay, here we go. This is. This is a mutual question, okay, so I can, I can do that. specific, I can right? Share a question. It says, how did you guys meet? And this is from Mutual Friends. So, uh, Mutual, um, it's the same old story. You know, you've read about it in all the romance novels. You've seen it a thousand times. Girl needs guitar player. Guitar player uh, needs a gig. Yeah, I mean, it's the same thing. And then, uh, there, know, there's some funny sides to the story. We'll, we'll put that in another that, video. That is kind of a, a longer uh, response. But, yeah. yeah, we met through music to give you a short thing. But we'll, we'll go back and do a you know full story on that one. Um, but I, I, here's a good one, and I'm, I'm glad this one came up. I, I've been like wondering, none of you know, we are a two o, uh, you know, musical two o. Yes, we are. And nothing has been about music to this point, so it's I'm true. glad. Well, this hmm. one comes in. It says, Kimberly, have you ever played with anyone famous? Ooh, a question for me. Yeah, this one says uh, someone who already knows the answer. Oh, thank you, somebody who already knows the answer for um, asking that question. Mm -hmm. Well, yes, I have. Um, I toured for a while with Vince Vance and the Valiants. I was a Valiantette, and Who's my that? name was Venus. Venus. Who's that? Yeah. Who's Venus or oh Vince Vance? Um, a lot of you will be familiar with him, and if you aren't, you're familiar with the song that he was famous for writing, "All I Want for Christmas Is You." Um, All I want for Christmas is you. I thought you were gonna say the Mariah Carey one. Didn't she do one too? She did, but that's not Vince Vance. So oh. anyway, um, and because of him, I got to perform with Irma Thomas and. Got to open for Harry Connick Jr. and Gary Sinise with the Lieutenant Dan Band. And at, on during Mardi Gras, if you're on our Facebook friend, I will always repost the picture of myself and Harry Connick Jr. It's like her like like greatest like she's got like kids and all that kind of junk, but that's her like greatest moment in her life. It really, right? it really, truly it's a dumb is. picture. Of her, it's to be not honest. at all. It's yeah. a wonderful picture, and you're just jealous. Because you've never played with anybody famous. That's not entirely true. Uh, I did play with Leonard Skinner. Um, Leonard Skinner or Little Skinner? No, no. I mean, it's legit. Like, that's a whole different story. Well, well, I gotta remind me. I'll do a whole video okay, on that. Another but, one. But it is. I. It wasn't like you know Leonard Skinner necessarily. It was like people who played for Leonard Skinner. I uh, gotcha. And, okay. and like their dark years that I did play. Anyway, that's a, it, it's the story is legit. I could make that claim, and I'll put a vi I'll put a video answering that one. All right. Um, oh, come on now. Here we go. This is another one for you. See? Okay, all right. This one says, Kimberly, are you or have you ever been into women? Oh. From uh, another hot redhead. <coughs> um, well, I don't okay, I don't know what you're doing here. But, um, <coughs> oh, okay. 
that seemed to be <coughs> okay. allergy attack. Okay, that's enough. All right. Um, well, I'm, I'm probably yeah, allergic to you. I know you probably are, but um, I, I would, I, w I would love to do, I would love to see a video about this later myself. <laughs> oh, I'm so, sure you would. <laughs> uh, we will be getting that installment at some point. Um, okay, now uh, this one just coincidentally happens. To, it's about, it says Danny. Mm -hmm. um, no big deal, right? It says Danny. I've seen you post about me before. I guess that means I've been on your mind from sexy neighbor. <laughs> I told you. What did you tell me? I mean, you didn't tell me nothing. I mean, I told you. I she was. You said she. I asked you. You said she wasn't even our friend. She's not. At all. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, that. Just, Somebody's got a stalker. Well, just remind me that we need to go through our privacy settings and adjust a few things. <laughs> um, but um, so anyhow, we're just going to move right along. Uh, this one, here's another question. It says, Facebook is old. Get on Snapchat, Insta, Tinder, and Twitter from you know who. Okay, on the on the one, uh, yes, I know who you know who is. Um, on the B, um, that, this is not even a question. This is just the it's statement. Directed. Yeah, this is a statement. Um, so maybe you need to reevaluate re your the ability to answer ask questions here <laughs> and then on the on the three tinder uh like i get i get the other ones on the social media but what are we going to do on tinder uh, i mean well, I, I know what to do on tinder well, but i don't know how it's going to help us well maybe maybe they know something we don't <laughs> yeah so um don't be surprised if Downloading i that app yeah tonight. don't be surprised if i start swiping on you tonight because <laughs> i'm getting it tonight and uh I, I swiping right is good right i'm just swiping right on yeah, everybody or, uh, or if you just like them i don't know i'm gonna swipe on everybody um, okay, so here's the last question. Um, uh, uh, this one, okay, we get this one a lot. It says, "Are you two really just friends?" And this one's from Curious. So I don't, I don't know who's why. Curious? I don't know who's curious. If, I mean, maybe you know, like, if they're asking if I'm available or. Um, why are they going to be asking if you're available? Well, I mean, come on. Then. Uh, no. So anyhow, uh, we'll see. Uh, basically, in there was in 1989. Uh, I believe that was the year there was the Berlin Wall and it fell um, and then in 19 which created unity yeah so it's Instead all about bringing Germany and it's, Germany. it's all about bringing people together really is, is you really the, the you could buy the pieces of the wall oh I had seen that you can you could buy a space rock too you could buy moon rocks also yes you um, can do that you can and you can actually you what you can do is you can buy a star like I could like I can call right now and I could 1-800 and say hey uh, my name is Danny. Please make make me a star. Make make you a star. Well, that I mean they don't make it, but if I you, yeah. So anyway, so basically, um, I mean, I, you know, I hope that answers your question. Uh, and it, unfortunately, we are out of time. We are, but thanks so, for all your questions. Uh, yeah, and no. We'll probably do another one of these, so don't you know? Go yeah, ahead keep and keep so keep uh, them coming. Put put them on. You know, you you text or you know, ask them in the questions, and we'll we'll get to we'll get to as many as we can. Uh, that's all the time we got for today, so we thank everybody for joining us. And uh, drive safe, though, mostly. Tip your waitresses and yeah, bartenders. Yeah, and uh, thanks, everybody. Hope you have a good night. Cheers. Oh, yeah, here, cheers.